Yo, 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 yo. It's your boy, Isaac Anzu. Totally normal, totally cool, totally in control, totally myself, 100% real, 100% genuine, organic, grass-fed, uh, free-range, uh, <laughs> lyrical, clerical, and chimerical. That's right. All this packaged in a VTuber that you can't resist. What's up, Incorporation Nation? You know I'm getting on that advertising grind. And look at this place. Oh, it's just inspiring some beautiful, mm, beautiful, beautiful words in me. Where the fuck do I go? Well, at least I can, uh, at least I can, right? At least I can, uh, at least I can, my horse. Bro, a bear. We've discovered the, the local wildlife. They are hostile. We must eliminate. Ah. Oh, more red bears. Hmm. That really makes me wonder. Really makes me wonder. Really makes me wonder. Is there another big red bear around here? I have a boss. I have a boss list. Actually, I could just look at that. It's a bear sanctuary. Shadows and flowers? Yeah. What the heck? That's something I expected to pick up here. Hmm. This seems like a place untouched by the shadow tree, but maybe, maybe it's starting to take it over. All right, uh, let's look at the boss list. No, there's not a bear over here. Bell, the black dread. Use me, stir, rude. Uh, mm, mm -hmm. Bell, I will riddle with holes your rotten hide with the hail of harpoons with every last drop of my being. God, that guy had some fun doing that, didn't he? All right. I need to explore this beautiful place. La, 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 la. I wonder why I can summon. Is there a boss here? Maybe I should summon. Let's summon. Eh? Ho, ho, ho. Look who it is. Our old friend. Don't think I ain't noticed you, buddy. Oh, hello. <laughs> okay, two of them. Uh, you take that one. I'll take this one. Surely that will work. What's the maximum uh, revered spirit ash? Palm glass. And palm blast. Yeah, that's right. Get him with the palm blast. Mimic tier. Is the other guy gonna join or not? There we go. Actually, perfect timing. Welcome, friend. You're too late. 
save your friend. No, come on, I want to do the double palm blast. I want to do the double palm blast. You can't stop me. Ah, oh, yeah, get him with the palm blast. My shadows. Oh, nice. Oh, wait, I'm out of juice. It ain't my fault that I'm out here getting loose. But I need some more blue juice. <clears throat> Hello, JD. Good to see you. Ooh. <laughs> It's kind of nostalgic fighting these guys, huh? Just a classic old halberd tree sentinel. Boop. No, get back here. I want to boop. Oh, that boops me so hard. <laughs> Fuck Bale the Gale. Well, now. Let's remember to not use the word gay in a derogatory sense. Unless Bale is actually super into Dragon Dick. Then that's perfectly acceptable. Is he? <laughs> What's the lore? Why were they fighting? Shaman Village. Are we finally going to meet a shaman that's not turned into a pop man? This is a very bright tree. Oh, there's an item. <gasps> Minor aired tree. 70 faith. Wow. Only the kindness of gold without order. A secret incantation of Queen Merica. Creates a small illusory herd tree that continuously restores the HP of nearby allies. America bathed the village of her home in gold, knowing full well that there was no one to heal. <gasps> America was the last shaman. Everyone else was taken away. Everyone else was turned into jars. That's kind of horrific. Um... And, uh, yeah. So she has the minor air tree spell. We learned that, that, um, weird tree. It's got a, oh, it's got a thing in it. A golden braid. Uh, how is that? Oh, boosts holy damage by the utmost. Braid of golden hair cut loose. Queen America's offering to the grandmother. What was her prayer, her wish, her confession? There was no one left to answer, and America never returned home again. Home! So this is the grandmother statue, huh? Well, if I know my Elden Ring, there's got to be an item at the very tip of this place. Like, look at it. Wait a minute. Is there a way down? Why else would they put that shit on the map? Hmm. Hmm. How deep does the lore go? How deep into Bale's asshole does the lore go? These are the questions that Miyazaki refuses to answer. Damn you, Miyazaki. Can you go down? You can totally go down. Right? Yeah. But why? But why? Just follow the grass. That's the rule for this DLC. No, too fat. No, oh, geez, almost died. Or maybe not. Maybe it's time to get off the horse. <laughs> uh, where next grass, please? 
Over here? Oh no. Oh! Okay, I think I missed a, a platform, but... Yeah, look at that. Woohoo! Secret tunnel! <gasps> Thing. Anna! Wait! Aren't we supposed to be like Jolan and Anna hunting? Is this Anna? Ah. Uh. Bell Magnish Bellberry. Oh, and then we're in the place with the Spell Magnish. All right, if I found Anna, what if I tell Jolan about Anna? They look the same. That's how you know they're sisters. Never were there such deserving sisters. Bail wants it in the butt. It's true. Can I? Oh, shit. Uh, I need to go. I need to go. I need to go. Um, whatchamacallit. I need to go and uh, see what the remembrance stuff is. What are we working on? We're work currently working on mind. Everything else is 20 or above. Jolyn, I found your sister. Enough of you. No, talk to me. Enough of you. Bruh. Where's Muir? Examine? What? Guess I missed out when Igor did shit. He's just a cheerleader now. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. We doing it? So here's Anna. Oh, I'm sorry, but my poise is stronger than that. Boop. Eh, he, 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 he. Boop. I love Palm Blast. Claws of Night. She was a recusant? Oh, shit. Claws of a bottomless black from which no light can escape. Wielded by Anna, Sword Hand of Night. Engraved with a smith script enabling strong attack to launch all three claws at the target. The blades are only semi corporeal and cannot be fully guarded against. Employ smithing arts to conjure multiple copies of the armament in both hands and throw them all at once. Follow with an additional input and throw again. Neat. So it's like infinite throwing daggers. Item. And another one of those hanging bells. We got the bells. We got the bells. We got the Finger Weaver's Cookbook, number two. Fingerprint Nostrum. What the fuck is that? This thing boosts mind, intelligence, faith, and arcane at the cost of gradual HP lost. Yeah, so it's dragon communion, flesh, and fingerprint nostrum are uh, kind of kind of doing the same thing as the sword seals. <laughs> Fuck this game. Are you fighting Bale currently? Is that what is that what is happening? Is this the is this the struggle the struggle of real? All right, give me a talisman or some shit. Eh? I cannot blow. Okay. Well, now I have beaten Anna in combat. Will Jolan talk to me? 
<laughs> I carried this Igor dude, Egon, uh, all around, no leg having ass, ass when I need him. I'm sorry to hear that, friend. I there, yes. That's one hell of a thing to see when I come in. It's just a big, big whistle, really. Okay. Uh, what the fuck am I doing? I'm going back here. <laughs> Curse you, Bale! From his wheelchair. Yeah, great job on the yelling, dude. I think I think he does actually like fire great bow shots and stuff like that, but it really does not do a lot. Probably, and and I think I think his most useful aspect is that Bale just has these huge, like, arena smoking AOEs, and he kind of directs them away from you. <laughs> uh, also, hello, Pirate Sprite. What, what'd, you, what'd you come in and see? Did you just come and see the big old finger? Finger man? Finger man, take me by the hand. Wait, you're just a hand. We need some shit to happen. Call the VA for help. Merked. That is me. Oh, I fucking should have just gone a little bit further and gone this thing. All right. If uh, it looked like a penis between two pillars. Uh, hey, man, that's on you. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, there are stairs down. OK, we could have gone down that way. OK, uh, looks like there's two paths. One leads to hole in the ground. The other leads to fingers. Did you kill the boar, dude? It took me like two weeks. Um. <laughs> uh, well, let me just say that Palm Blast is an excellent, excellent uh, weapon art. Um, it took me, I used the Mimic tier. I did. Um, and the Mimic tier's job was mostly to be, motherfucker. Uh, the Mimic Tears job was mostly to be sacrificed. Um, so that we, uh, so that we could get off an extra Golden Bow and Flame Grant Me Strength. All right, whatever the fuck is coming out of this. Falling Star Beast? Yep. Hello. No, thank you. I would like to palm blast your ass. Ready for the palm blasting. He's ready for the palm blasting. Look at the damage. I was palm blasting and blasting. So anyway, I started blasting. And eventually I was just giving guys a palm job. <laughs> palm job. That's a new one. All right, Sprite, you live in the gutter. Let's hear it. What's a palm job? Oh, brother. Sorry, but I have. I have the power of the buffest ass armor in the game, bro. You cannot defeat me. Ah, ha, ha. Take that, you son of a... Oh, Mimic. Oh, well, I guess I can heal my... Palm Blast! Fuck. With all this poison hyper armor, and it still gets me, huh? This is just... Isaac holds the button and, and prays.
What the hell are you doing there, buddy? At least it's not the fully grown falling star beast. That would be annoying. Whoop. You got some chat GPT mod streamer mimic. I know. The AI is just so cringe. Oh no, what's this? You're standing in one space for too long. <laughs> it should be a downfall. Gravitational missile? Fires a bolt of gravity that pulls in enemies before exploding. Hey, that's what the uh, what you got to go to what's what's good what's good what's good to, what's the, that's what you call uh that's what Gaius used. Said to have originated in the lightless dark far beyond, the home of the falling star beasts. Yeah, this uh this DLC is really leaning into like the outer outer gods lore that's going on. Oh, there's another grace right here. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. My status is the only <laughs> we know. He's out here getting crits. Be real. Nah. Chat GPT is cringe, man. It's just like, why? Look, it's a little mommy and, and daddy and the babies just going for a little walk out in the, out in the field. <laughs> Whoa, don't step on that. Uh, -huh. uh, my mimic is just making popcorn for five minutes. Then he decides to find a sword somewhere and it is a spoon. And he attacks a gallon of ice cream. Is everyone asleep here? Can we uh, approach easily? The finger ruins of Dio. Dio has rocks for a long, long time. Oh no, not you. No, 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 no. I get you. It was me, Dio. We must remove the dudes who will, uh... I see. Don't think I don't. No! What is this crunching sound? You can crack your teeth on my armor, bro. Man, I could go for a gallon of ice cream right now. I've been sick for a goddamn week. I need chicken noodle soup. I need ice cream. I need the tender comforts of a home cooked meal. Except, you know, I, I do I do cook like 90% of my own food. Blow, baby. Yeah, that's about what I expected to happen. Okay, same description as the other one. All right. Back to, uh, back to this place. By the way, if you want to farm runes, that bridge in the Ancient God Sword is legit. 70 G1 swing. Um, the Ancient God Sword, the, the one you get from beating the... Oh, Roboth's great force. Uh, the one you get from beating the Elden Beast. Yeah. And which which bridge? I mean, I know I know about the um, the palace approach ledge road. This little thing right here is like an insane amount of runes. But is there a bridge that's better? 
I'd be sick. I told you what. I've no interest in that account Ume. I did perhaps miss <laughs> companionship. Our meeting with the count, we know that we cannot reach out, but we can. We will never again. I have spoken. Pay me no mind. I'll serve it. No. The Highland Bridge. Oh shit. Here where everyone's sleeping? Waves of gold the snake dudes. Ooh. Okay, that does sound legit. Hell yeah. Hello, sir. I did your thing. I heard another thing. Did the stars ever guess too short? On the contrary. Love. Hey you. Oh yes, Miss Eden. Do you call the Marika? fingers that guide well it is their mother miss Dan. the fingers are but unripe children we all need a new mother may you join the so he is saying that whatever birthed the fingers oh i mean weren't we just there we were just underneath here so we just got to get him to move The Hinterland Bridge? This one? Are there dudes on here? Bridge? Yes. He moves off the chair so we can go down. Now, be on your way. Is he over here? Did his little finger baby die? Wave of gold their asses. Have I never seen this? I don't know, man. I'm doing the quest line. I was told to do this quest line in order to get uh, Jolin and Anna. I, okay. Repeatable steps. Talk to Ymir. Ring the hanging bell. Talk to Ymir. He disappears. Go under and go to the finger runes of Mir. Talk to Ymir. Go here. Talk to Ymir. He's in the cemetery. I'm gonna have to fight. <laughs> Fuck this game. Dude, I I found out that I talked to Freya in the wrong order of whatchamacallit in the the thing. Go under and fight it, dude. We already fought Anna. Who is down here? Is she coming back? And they get no things. I mean, this is the third rune. It'll let me blow the horn now, right? He gave me the map. Surely will let me blow the horn. You can ring my bell. Yeah. <laughs> ring my bell. <laughs> Drums. What the fuck? Uh, okay. Hello, Mimic Tear. Join me. Something is fuck over there. You blew all the cocks. Every cock was mine to blow. All right. Met here, mother of fingers. No, no, ow. Ooh, she's very flexible. Palm Blast. 7,000 damage. That must have been a counter hit. And... 
Palm Blast. Ooh, 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 ooh. Give me that. Crit. That's not that much damage. Should have just done another Palm Blast. Really? Oh, phase two. Phase two. Oh, God. What is happening? The Dark Sun has come for us all. Give me one more Palm Blast. Just one more. Just one more little Palm Blast. Or maybe two. Maybe two. Maybe two. Okay, step one, don't die. Yeah, makes sense. So many more lasers in phase two. I just want... No, I don't want the lantern. That's a big fucking laser beam. Goodbye, minutes here. Will you come the fuck down? I have a palm blast for you. Would you like it? She didn't like it. <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh, I thought she was going to do the explosion. Okay, now what? That's a remembrance boss. Let's read about the mother of fingers. How are you one-timing every boss? This is insane. Uh, it's called um, armor, <laughs> armor and palm blast, I guess. I'm Takey as a boy. Takey as a fuck, fucking. I'm Takey. I, I almost said Takey as a fuck boy, but that is not an accurate statement. The mother of all two fingers and finger creep was in turn a magnificently gleaming daughter of the greater will and the first shooting star to fall upon the lands between. Start invading people, become God. <clears throat> um, I have been thinking about trying my hand at PvP. Oh God, we're over 3,000, 300,000 runes needed to level up now. What a nightmare okay i'm guessing that there's no way out of this place so let's just go back to manis mater uh i don't know enough about what you i don't know about what you what you what you what you what you what you want i don't know enough about it um to invade people all right give me my quest reward please Where'd he go? Back down? What have you done? Oh no. Most irreparably. Oh boy. He wishes for your death. Uh gimme just a second, Jolan. Gimme just a second, Jolan. Gimme just a second, Jolan. Oh fuck it. If it has to be this way. I'm sorry. My dear star, my mother, you will be my shining star. Oh god. He's here too. Alright. Let's uh Oh god. He just he makes them fingers, huh? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Wait, where'd he go? There he is. Ah. Uh. Palm blast. Okay, well that Palm blast. Oh my god, the damage. <laughs> palm blast. Paul Oh wait, I'm out of palm blast. He was a boss? Okay. Truly, I decided to be your mother. Ooh. Lots of stuff. So his bell bearing, yes. The maternal staff carried for want of tail fingers of his own. Why? 
The crystal ball, representative of a microcosm, will not receive any sign. Boost finger sorceries. The fuck is a finger sorcery? Wait. Uh... We got another thing like that recently, didn't we? Piece of armor. Boosts a different kind of sorcery. No, a weapon, a weapon. We got a weapon recently that boosts a different kind of source. Yeah, okay, here. Boost Mesmer's Flame Incantations. Where's... Yeah, here. So why does this say Sorcery and Incantation? Gold embroidery decorates the purple cloth with a jeweled ruff that sparkles like a flower with wet dew. Uh, sorry, I got the totally distracted. Uh huh. The circular design at the top represents the greater will and its lightless abyss, imparting increased intelligence and arcane to the wearer. Nice. Though Count Emir instructed Rolana in the Sorcerer's Arts, he abandoned his allegiance to the moon. It was merely the closest of the celestial bodies, nothing more. Ooh. He found the real celestial body. Soft and well tailored. It's not for me. Um. Okay. That damage, though. Woo! Woo Palm Blast! Uh, I'm gonna reload the area one more time. Because surely... Yes. Okay. Count you near. Alright, let me just make sure I'm doing this right. Because this is how you get Jolan and uh, 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 and, uh, right? DLC Spirit Ashes. Give Jolan the Iris of Grace. Okay. Here's your Iris of Grace. Yeah. Okay, now we take, now we take Jolan to Anna. What are your stats? Uh, let me, let me get going here and then I can show you. Uh, so I have my main attack stat is strength for 55. Um, I also have a secondary stat of faith 40. I did 20 dex int, int and arcane in order to uh, use whatever weapons I came across. Endurance 45 so I can wear all this armor. Vigor 60. Uh, it kind of caps out at 60. I'm currently working on upping my mind. Um, but the real thing you want to look at is um, over there on the defense damage negation. I know my head's covering it a little, but look at that. 75% physical damage negation. That's the good shit. And you get that from the Dragon Crest Shield Talisman and all of these armor pieces. Um, 
I missed my turn. Fuck. 60 dex, 57 strength, and 60 arcane. That's some, that's some, that's, that's like really good attack stats. Um, I don't know. I think that, I think the thing is, I'm just like wearing the heaviest armor I can find. Cause I have 45 endurance, so I can do it. I can do it without a single talisman. Without a single like weight increasing talisman. So we have the Godfrey icon and the Shard of Alexander to just make palm blast. Uh just insanely good. Um oh yeah, and then uh the other thing is I changed my palm blast to a fire affinity. Uh so that because I have good faith. Um, and strength, the well, no, it's the flame art affinity, right? Fire is pure strength, but flame art is strength and faith. Uh, so by using flame art, I can use my 40 faith as well to increase the fire damage. Faith is the plan in this DLC, faith seems to be good. It's letting me cast all my buffs, too. Also, Dolu's idea of using the 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 blue infinite FP thing. Uh, we didn't end up using it for um, summoning. But we did end up using it. Let's uh, let's get off the horse here. We did end up using it for buffing, and honestly, it's like possibly better. Let's go. Hello, Anna. Usher Anna into Sword Hand of Night Jolin's Spirit Ashes. Yeah, ushered Anna into Sword Hand of Night Jolin's Spirit Ashes. No. So now we have two badass babes. Spirits of the two sword hands of night, one of them being possessed by Count Ymir's doll, Anna. Together, Jolin's sword and Anna's claws are bottomless black and penetrate the enemy's guard. Jolin and Anna were born in a cold, dark jail where they were raised to practice light to be sword hands of night. Thus were they cultivated to become the most terrifying masters of their blades, though the burden of their deed left their hearts frail and pliant. Gross. <laughs> I hope you like bleed. They bleed like nothing you've ever seen. Well, shit. Let's go. <laughs> I should have enough. Yeah, so let's go back to the round table. I need to I need to check what these um uh what these remembrances do. Sword Lance. Blades of Stone. Uh, Gaius and Radon were good rivals in their youth, and this sorcery is a product of their friendly competition. A combination of greatsword and lance. Weighty and capable of being brought to bear with great force, this armament shows its true potential when used to stride a mount. Gaius himself was never without his boar. A gravity skill honed by the disciples of an alabaster lord he uses gravitational power to hang in the air before rotating the body and charging forward. Okay, yeah, we want this weapons when possible. Lands of Shadow. Fire hail of golden projectiles towards foes. This incantation channels the force of the scattered tree's power and his gold is accompanied by shadow. This is the ship that killed me. Uh, the Shadow Sunflower Blossom. A colossal weapon that does physical and holy damage and scales on faith. The head of a monstrous shadow sunflower, manifestation of the scattered tree. Then again, it might just be a flower wheeled as a, as a weapon. Much like the scattered tree itself in appearance, a second stalk winds tightly around the first, almost as if in a tender embrace. Slam down the blossom of a large shadow sunflower, sending out a shockwave that flattens foes. Repeated inputs allow for up to two follow attacks. Yes, please. All right, and then we've got um, Remembrance of the Mother of Fingers. 
We've got the Gazing Finger, which is a colossal weapon, and the Staff of the Great Beyond, which is a glintstone staff. That's the one that you were saying was really, really good, huh? All right, let's read the Gazing Finger first. The head of Matir, the Finger Mother, wields as a weapon without modification. Just grab that head and smack people around with it. From the center of the fingerprint that wrinkles the creature's foremost protrusion, a tiny wart-like eye gazes vacantly into the beyond. Cow Tower's resentment. Skill performed using... Skill performed is a violet bow using the finger's foremost protrusion. Resentment builds as it is forced to bow, making it explode with anger. Hold button down to further increase resentment. Staff action from the tail fingers of Matera, the mother of fingers, and the microcosm raised aloft over the crux they form. Catalyst for both sorcerers and incantations. Nice. The mother receives signs from the greater will from beyond the microcosm. Despite being broken and abandoned, she kept waiting for another message to come. All right. I am no mage, so we will take that. Is there new equipment? Yes, there is. Gaius's helm, Rolana's helm, Esmer's helm. Gaius's armor is kind of sick. Where's that shit? Gaius's helm. Gaius's armor. Yeah, look at that shit. Gaius was the most senior disciple of the same alabaster lord who taught Radon and Gaia gravitational technique. Who the fuck is Gaia? They were there when the... So, uh... Mesmer. The winged snakes were Mesmer's constant companions. They were there when the base serpent was sealed away behind his eye. They were there through his eternity of suffering. They will accompany him yet in his hideous new form born when he destroyed the grace granted by his mother. <coughs> they have accepted his fate as much as he. So Mesmer wasn't born with the serpent. He had the serpent sealed in him. Some Naruto-ass shit. Ornala, head of the royal family, was said to have a younger sister. Who renounced her lineage to chase after Mesmer, a gift of lustrous black hair. Direct thy maledictions, thine ire, and thine grief towards me alone. Uh. Uh huh. Loretta. Rolana. Gaius. Mesmer, Rolana, Gaius, Mesmer, Rolana. Okay. Just trying to make sure I don't miss any secret lore. I see. Yes, I'm here for some spirit tuning. Uh, where's my twin ladies? Let's get bleeding let's get physical physical i want to get wait a minute 144 to caught to cast well we're almost there we're at 116 and we are planning on uh whatchamacallit okay do i want to uh, upgrade any of these things. The big weapons, probably yes. So, let's see. I'm not really feeling the Shadow Sunfire, but it does do holy damage. This is magic damage. Interesting. Where's the... Where's the... Where's the Gaius weapon? Sword Lance. Yes. Give me the sword, Lance. They bleed like nothing you've ever seen. I'm I'm ready. I want to see the spinning gravity thrust, too. I want to get physical, physical. I want to get physical. Let's get physical. 
Uh, spirit sword. That was like nothing, right? Um, Great katana, dragon hunter's katana, black steel twin blade. Right. Okay. These both take sombers, huh? Oh, there's the tooth whip. I don't think that's for me. Claws of night, also sombers. Man, every, so much is sombers. I don't think we use these for anything else then. Okay, let's go try out uh, these weapons. To the gauge punch. All right, I do want to see if this is possible. Uh, let's. All right, let's switch out our summon. So drink, summon, blessing, golden vow, flame grant me strength. All right, Jolin and Nana, let's see what you're capable of. At plus 10. Hey, Peter. Hey, Peter. There you go. All right, girls, fuck them up. Oh, you want a piece of me? Goodbye. See, this is what this is what good armor gets you. Damn. All right. I see how it is. Holy shit. Okay, I do love that there's two of them. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Good. 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 All right, um, we want to try out. Well, I really just want to see these attacks. Got it, got it. And what's the shadow sunflower headbutt? Cool. Not too, uh, not too intensive on the, the FP either. All right. So basic colossal weapon move set and now cow towers resentment Ooh. hey that could be a good aoe type thing it doesn't have quite the range as the other spells the other things though all right now there's the sword lance i might possibly use this one So it's got kind of piercing slashing. All right. Yo, now that is sick. All of a sudden, I'm, I'm using so much. Okay. Um, D 
do we try taking out a boss with that thing? Sure. All right. 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 Okay. So I looked up the next place we got to go. And it is the Fijua. A French word, I'm guessing. Because this seal is gone, as you can see. Oh, shit. Uh, uh, okay. So, um, no sword lance unless we uh, increase our endurance a little more. And I guess, well, you know, I guess if we're, if we switch to the sword lance here, let's see if this works. We still want the skill boost. But the charged boost is not as important. So what if I put on Erdtree's favor and then the sword lance? Are we medium load? No. What about Great Jar Arsenal? There we go. Medium load. Medium load. This area seems dangerous. Like it would be an easily fallable area. Valuable? Fallable? Oh, hello. Wait, why am I... Why am I falling asleep? Are these guys not blood fiends, but are they sleep fiends? They're eep fiends, eepiness. Eepiness is their game. Honk. They've got the power of the sacred honk shumimimimi. All right. All right, all right. It's it's good damage. It's no palm blast, but the damage is very nice. Yeah, okay. Can't fool me, motherfucker. Oh no, your jump attacks. Goodbye. Your poise can't match my sword lance. Got him. It uses up a good amount of the uh, oh, which pellet. But how's the AOE potential? Well, if I do it double, it's like an instant. Uh, stun on these guys. That's nice. I like the range, too. It's a pretty good weapon. But I think I still prefer the Palm Blast. I mean, isn't that what we've spent this entire run doing? Beating people up with our fists? The Palm Blast is just an extension of my will this point. Hey, Ray, how's it going? Good to see you. How am I? How are you? You're like a college man now. Cool. Playing seven days to die right now to cool off. Cool, cool. How's it going? Is it a good game? I heard there was a lot of hype around it. I don't know anything about it, though. Friends. <laughs> All I've been doing is trying to shade armor. Shade armor? Like a joke? 
It's one of your faves. Very cool. Yeah, these guys do uh, sleep damage. Like, what the heck? Brother. I. Sleep. I sleep. Real shit. What were you guarding? A Shadow Realm rune. Three. One of your favorites. Hey. We love a good grace. I could talk to this guy real quick, right? Kindly Nicola, so you've thrown away something you should not have under any circumstances. How will you salvation offer to those who cannot be saved? when you could not even save your other self. Scatter tree fragment. I abandon here my love. Oh no. Oh, Mikola. You can't throw that away. Why, how could you? How could you? Your love? Bird. How's Elden ringing? Well, I'm pretty sure that Mikola and St. Trina were dating. And uh, Mikola is all like, nah. <gasps> all hail mighty Sir Isaac, ghost communication expert, scatter tree fragment collector. Listener of background music. Take that and that and that and that. These things are purple too. It's all sleeping around here. St. Trina does the sleeping stuff. We know this. <laughs> uh, so Dolu, here's what we picked up. Um, we got a giant finger. We got a giant sunflower. We got a sword lance. And we have Jolin and Anna. Oh, and we beat up some dude uh, and found Merica's hair. And um, how are them ashes? Well, I went and tested them with Peter and the gang and they seem pretty good. Uh, have not had a chance to fight a boss with them yet. <laughs> You're sniping zombies right now? Isn't the Tarnished technically a zombie? Like, look at these, these birds have purple wings. I know how to beat you. Palm Blast. Is there anything it can't solve? Uh, yeah, so... Uh, I did the finger runes of Rhea, and then there were finger runes underneath the church, and then there were finger runes all the way over here. Oh, yeah, there was, like, tree sentinels here, too. Um, and then we found Anna over here, and this is, like, the shaman village where America is from. Pretty cool. Um, but, yeah, then we beat up the Mother of Fingers, and then we beat up the Count Ymir, the other mother of fingers. I don't know. So far, we've had quite the time. Last I saw, you were dealing with sewer recruits. Oh, um, this lore makes no sense. What's not to what's not to understand? It's perfectly clear and, and delivered in a very concise and uh, easy to understand way. Oh fuck! What are you? Nope. Oh fuck! Ow! I smack you. Did he not hit, hit me because I was too close? 
Saint Trina is Mikola. But a uh, fire is serving me wonderfully. I'm very happy with fire. Oh fuck. The flame art in particular with the, the faith scaling as well. Another part of her shedding everything to become a god. Still pretty sure Mikkel is the dude. But, um. Interesting. The putrescence is what remains of the impure lives kept within the stone coffins. Huh. So Saint Trina and Mikola are the same thing. I mean, we also know that like Merica is Radon. So it's not unheard of to have multiple people be like the same same view. Mikola is a god in the lands between. Uh, yeah, like the uh, sister of God. Dodge. The sister of Melania, right? Melania, Blade of Mikula. Blade of Mikula. Melania, Blade of Mikula. Wow. Icy flower. Oh, but. Give me a second. I'm trying to pick the flowers. Nectar Blood Virgin. Well, okay, that makes more sense because this is sent to Virgin forth with a nectar like blood of abandoned Saint abandoned Trina pool. So he abandoned his love and America is Mikola? No, no is whatever gender she wants to be. Well, I mean, that is fair. Uh, God genders are pretty um, up in the air. But I think... I think I don't think I've ever read this. It is said that when the scatter tree crumbles from its core that it will scatter across the entire realm of shadow. The people in the air tree collect the splinters and use them in prayer. I think everything I've ever read calls Mikola male, but you are correct. Gods are just whatever they feel like. <laughs> um, but I thought Merica was, I thought Merica and Radagon were Mikola's parents. She's just a shaman trying to ascend to godhood. I think she pretty much did it. <laughs> right? In the lands between, she's a god. Oh, what's this? Crepe Glove Wart 7. Probably not worth it at this point. In the lands between, she's a god. This is a prequel. This is a prequel. How is that possible, though? Doesn't Nicola need... Um, like, this can't be in the past, because Nicola needs the bodies that we killed to... Uh, Hello, sir. Mikola needs the bodies that we killed in the present to do his little Frankenstein boyfriend shit. Yeah, to become a god. Oh, come on. <laughs> Mikola is male, but damn, they dominate the gender spectrum. It's true. Is this all there is over here? Just a dude. Then now we fight the big guy. This is what I call pod racing. 
Lumi was not prepared for that shit. You should always be prepared for pod racing. Has Star Wars Episode One: The Phantom Menace taught you nothing? Just a little bit. Just a little 15,000 damage there. On one bar of stamina. Wow, I broke its poise. It has poise, huh? 22,000 HP and you couldn't do shit. <gasps> Hello? I mean, if we're talking about ease of understanding, I don't think Elden Ring lore is going to win any awards. <laughs> buffs, baby buffs. One shot that shit. They're a god over there. Maybe I'm wrong, but this is their journey and the folk to get there. Hmm. Yeah, I... So, where did I remember hearing this? It was on an item description, of course. <sighs> this light ring incantation was cultivated by a tradition separate from the Golden Order fundamentalism. It was... It was... Um, the future one is a crazy warrior. The other is a pedophile. Uh... <laughs> um, but wasn't Mika wasn't Mikola? I keep I keep wanting to say Michaela. Wasn't Mikola the one enchanting Moog? Uh, hello. You know what this calls for? Testing out a new weapon. Would you like to see Cow Towers present? Yeah, not bad. Puts me in heavy load though. Tish, 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 tish. They're just normal animals. They're just sleepy animals. We didn't know about mess. That's true. So, okay. I need to. I. There's a summoning pool here. We should see if we can level up. Probably not. Until the past, she was a shaman, hated the horn scent. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because the horn scent were the ones that turned the shamans into jars. And then she was like the last shaman. And she was all like, I should sit at the grace, actually. Because uh, I don't have my wondrous physic, and that's important. Rest at sight of grace. But really, I mean, what's another level or two? It's like nothing. I think the scattered tree fragments are a lot more important. So this has to be like the boss, right? Oh, please grant me the courage to fly to your feet, my dearest. St. Trina. Everybody's all into St. Trina here. Gave birth to Joffrey Briathon, told him to deal with the horn set. That is so true. Like, dear Joffrey Baratheon, I promise I'll love you if you go kill the people who massacred my my hometown. I did it, mother. Are you proud of me? No. Be sealed in the land of shadow. <laughs> All right. I have not died instantly. This is a good sign. Falling. Okay.
Let's do this, motherfuckers. Who are you? Is a dude. The putrescent knight. Oh, jeez. He's a creepy looking guy. What the hell is this attack? How am I supposed to palm blast? Stay still. Uh, good damage. Good damage. All right, girls. Get him. It's a boomerang. Oh, God. What are you doing? What are you doing? Frost. Oh, the girls are not faring well. That's okay. One down. Yo. Can we, uh... Hell yeah. That would be... Like a boss. That was another remembrance boss. Oh, who is this? All tainted flesh eventually becomes putrescence, and this clump of it imbibed St. Trina's nectar, which granted it eternal rest. And so it was that putrescence became her knight. All right, let's see. I missed, I missed some lore discussion. All the parts of Mikola that are left around are the parts they left behind, but gained all the ailments, sleep, bleed, rot, poison, ice. Oh shit. Hell yeah. Okay, so I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. So sleep, uh, there was a poison area. There have been some poison areas. She took that and overstepped the lanes between now that people are and stuff. You are at sleep now. That is cool. Okay, so. Um, is madness on there too? What was the scatter tree? Bleed, probably, with all the thorns, right? Bleed, sleep. Ice, because the divine line was, like, icy. There's no, there's no discarded. Madness is there. That's uh, not very helpful. <laughs> uh... I th there's there's like definitely a chat delay so if you say like there stop there it's never gonna be where i am you haven't seen madness yet no i haven't uh there is there's this whole map area that i haven't found yet i don't think you go down from here we tried going down from here we actually got down to the elder's hovel by going down the the lake, I think. Yeah, we could go down this way, but that was like all edge. And then this way was just the Bonnie Jail. So the only the only thing left is down here. I don't think I've been down here because we crossed the bridges up. But we haven't gone down. I'm going down. I'm yelling timber. Oh, we're in another safe zone. Item. St. Trina's Disciples Cookbook. Yo. The Lulling Branch. What does that do? It's an it's the very first one. Oh cool. Slowly builds up sleep while gradually restoring FP. Oh, that's cool. Pierce oneself, causing a gentle buildup of sleep. FP gradually recovers during this time. When the sleep reaches the threshold of causing temporary fogginess, no FP loss is incurred. Oh. 
In the midst of drowsiness, there is the will to awaken, feelings that rise from the depths of one's heart. She took all those ailments and used them to take control of the lands between, and backfired in the night of dark times. Yeah, because death is death is not really an ailment, right? All right, what's the big flower? Talk. Imbibe the nectar. Wait, is that a face? Okay. Imbibe the nectar. Give me some nectar. How is it? Die four times here, huh? Four times? Is that is that it? <laughs> Three more, hot huh, rod. Is that all you do here? Is just die? Over and over and over again. Yeah, all right. I'll imbibe your nectar. <clears throat> Is this Saint Trina? You didn't find Polier? Uh, no, he's still back at the other place. DLC NPCs. Saint Trina. Is Tiolia here? No, he's over here. She is heartbroken Saint Trina. Never chose him. I think we may need it. I think we may need it to talk to. Okay. Kinjo King. Hi. All right. Now is he here? We've died twice. I hope that didn't break the sequence. Ah, he's here. This is the shattest shit I've ever seen. All he wants is to be accepted. Yeah, well, I mean, it's like the downtrodden, right? Uh, Mikola's, Mikola's love abandoned. I'm guessing if Trina is Mikola, then Trina is like Mikola's love, right? All she wants is love. Beep, 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 beep. All right. Was that three or four? I guess it doesn't matter. I'll do it as long as I have to do it. I followed your example, buddy. Okay. Hello. I guess that was three. One more time. Time to die.
Make Michaelis, make Michaelis stop. Oh. Don't turn the poor thing into a god. Into Mikula, Mikula, Malakath, Mikula. Everyone's damn names are too fucking similar. All right. Okay, and then we're supposed to do it again. As Saint Trina is discarded, she knows what will happen as her son sits on the elven throne. She has a son? Or is she talking about both Tellier? Genocide, and not how you spell that, but that's okay. It didn't say you died this time. Godhood would be Nicholas' prison. Cage divinity is beyond saving. Sadness. Hello, Tialia. I know you're very mad at me right now. But I have <laughs> the power of Palm Blast. Your poison is useless. Saint Trina's smile. Tialia has died? Back in hell. Uh, what do we get here? Sleep in the vicinity increases attack power. Yo, wait, that's actually cool. Good versus got skin duo. Only I am allowed to know of your velvety sleep. It's sweetly gentle embrace. So please smile for me and only me. He's a lover, not a fighter. Damn. As the air tree grew in the lands between, Mikola slash, slash America's power grew with it. All right. She didn't want to lose any of her loves to death. I mean, understandable. She broke the rune of death. Yeah, because death was removed from the lands between. Grant him forgiveness. Mm, grant him forgiveness. Mm -hmm. Gender. <laughs> Your point of gender being super fluid in the gods is still plundo percento accurate hello
Is that it? Okay. <laughs> that is what you're supposed to do. Okay. Well, uh, fortunately, we did beat the, the guy here, and we did the quest line stuff. So now what? We've gone this way. We've gone this way. The Grace is telling us to go over here. We still haven't found this. We still haven't found this. Right? You helped destroy the king. You helped to destroy the kingdom of the corrupt god Nicola. Well, I mean, it was the Elden Beast, wasn't it? Oh yeah. Okay. There's another thing I'm supposed to do. According to the boss list, there is another boss uh, this way. The Dolo and I just sped right past on our our journey. Who wants power? Uh, yeah, America shattered the rune and imbued the ru the rune of death. <coughs> America shattered the Elden Ring and imbued the rune of death into Malaketh for safekeeping. Boop. 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 All done. Easy. Dolu feels sad. Oh, no, don't feel sad, Dolu. Honestly, a lot of this stuff is like research stuff, you know. It's fun to go kill these bosses. They're not as hard as I expected. Oh, brother. You want to dance with me? I want to dance with you. Uh, this way this time? OK. Smack. Don't be sad, Dodo. I did actually, I took your advice and I um, saved a backup of the file exactly where we were. Medieval Terminator shit. Yeah, according to the map, you should have a spirit spring there. I do not have the power of shackle. Where is the stones? Oh, they're exactly where one would expect them to be. Okay. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Well, but you know, it's like, uh... so recently in Magic the Gathering, they did a cowboy set and Magic the Gathering is a traditionally like high fantasy sort of thing. And like cowboys? What the heck? Where are these cowboys coming from? Yes, here is the boss that is supposed to be here. So you made all the story up. I mean, some parts of it I know are true. Um, okay. Still not enough to do all my buffs at once. But what I can do is do all my buffs. Red bear. And then this. Join me, ladies. 
he's a bear. <gasps> he's got the loose helmet on. No. Stand still so I may punish you for for stealing Dolu's helmet. Now make a lore vid and become famous. I mean, there's a lot of lore vids already out there. Take that, Dolu's helmet stealer. Uh, red bears shit. Just make it up. Paint the waters. Turn everyone against each other. After killing the great red bear in a blood-soaked bout, he became fascinated by the untainted glory of its naked strength. I wish to be a bear, no more, no less. The cheek guards are shaped after lion fangs. Perhaps his fascination with the untamed strength of the wild stemmed from his past as a red name. So it's just a dude who, whose name is lost to madness. And he wanted to become a bear. Slaughters prey with sharp claws and a great sweep of the arm. The attack creates a vacuum which deals continuous damage. Repeated inputs allow for up to two follow-up attacks. Causes blood loss buildup. That's nice. All right, let's try out Red Bear Hunt. So it's got the Beast Claw move set. Pretty standard. What's Red Bear Hunt? Ooh. I love all these chainable Ash of Wars. Like, really, really cool. Okay, another one bites the dust. They scale with strength, not dex. What else am I supposed to do here? Okay, Davy. How do you get here? Tell me. Tell me. How the fuck do you get there? Okay, I got you. Thank you. Because that's like the only possible way left. Unless you like teleport into here. Like I've explored every single area around here. There's nothing else. There's no way. Go to the boar guy. Okay. Up here. Scatter view. And there is way more. Okay. All right. The back door. Of the shadow key. But this is how we got to the board guy. Is by going through the back door of the Shadow Keep. Oh wait, I should status. 310. <laughs> Shush! You shushing me? Let me see the map. I'm trying to get here. This way is too high. This way is too high. This way is too high. It's all too high. Is there... Is it connected to the Shadow Keep? Oh, I should... I should see what the putrescent light thing does. All right. Let's go... Um, oh, I know where to go. First floor storage room. Okay. Yes. Give me just a second. I'm going to go level up. 
And I have the perfect place to level up. Climb the ladder with the helmet. Wonder why you can't go. I'll get there, I'll get there, I'll get there. I just want to get a few runes to level up, okie dokie. We'll be right there. Just wanna, just wanna, I just wanna give this guy a little bit of a, a little bit of a palm blast. Somehow, storehouse first floor. <laughs> Walk outside, kill the dude. Okay, I just need like 10, I just need like a thousand more runes. There's a dude right here. Hello, you. Congratulations, you've been chosen. Yes, now I can level up and not have to run around with 300,000 runes. Uh, we need to pump endurance more. You used to be cool. Walk outside, like take the elevator outside. Man, I was never cool. What made you think that? I'm a nerd. Walk outside, kill the dude. I can do that. It's just like a fairy tale. Turn left. Wait, what? Turn right or left? I'm at the weird ass burning ships. <laughs> ships, ships. I'm at the weird ass burning ships. Left. Okay. No, come on. Rude. Jumping over the palm blast. How did you even do that? Murder them. Is there another ladder? Left side. This ladder? We went down here. Did we miss something down here? Now what? That leads down to the paint. Oh god. Uh... I'm just gonna... Check! Oh! It's just not the same. Turn around? Is it here? Something else down here? Let me down. There you go. Yeah, la 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 I was painting blind. I was so blinded by my love of art. What's that? A coffin? Don't mind if I just get the fuck in it. I know how Elden Ring works. I know how Dark Souls... I know how Dark Souls works. Lantern, please. Oh, yes, of course.
Yes, you crazy red-headed casket-hating dumbass. Listen, I can't deny any word in that statement. <laughs> Except crazy. I'm perfectly sane. All right. Where the hell am I? A room leading outside. Lantern. A grace. Is this the place? Oh my God. Back and finally. <laughs> the same person with a huge witch's. Don't think I don't see you. We're just gonna go around. It's gonna go around the furnace golem. Explore a bit. God damn it! Okay. Time to, time to fight, I guess. He's, uh, he is vulnerable. That does not play guitar better than Slash. I am not Buckethead. But how can, how can, how can Slash's secret alter ego uh, not play guitar better than Slash? Mm hmm. <laughs> That's a controversial statement. Bruh. Changing the rules of stomping. Show me, show me in the guitar game. God, I'll show you me dying in game. How about that? Elven hero. <laughs> now there's there's a challenge run. Elden ring on a guitar hero controller. Wouldn't be too bad, would it? Fucking this motherfucking damage is so high. Is a shitty idea. Yeah. But I'm sure some challenge runner out there has probably done it. No, 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 don't do it. Uh -huh. Just avoid this hellhole you call a good idea. Oh shit, he's like, uh... Let's go, let's go. Not yet. Motherfucker, I thought he'd staggered twice already. You know, I gotta say, I'm I'm not uh I'm not a fan of this mechanic.
Come on. Interrupt. Fucking bullshit. This these bo these these furnace golems are just not good. <laughs> I'm nearing four tonight, and I hope I pass through the building DPS check. I hope you do too. Can I uh, craft more hefty furnace pots? I had a thought the other day. Drones on and on and on and on and on and on on and 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 on. They are so tough, but why? Why must they be like this? At least there are a bunch of furnace facages around here, right? Give them to me, baby. So I may craft. All right. Uh, wait. Oh, I'm out of furnace. Facilities. The challenge runner scene is real wild. Because you kind of have to be like the first person to do something, right? Way. Motherfucker. Or I can go to the horror shit. Oh, you mean for like war videos? Yeah, horror, horror lore is a big thing these days, isn't it? Oh, if you jump a little early, it's better than jumping a little late, huh? <laughs> Let's debate the price of the Civic. What's there to debate? It's a competitively priced car. <laughs> oh, shit. I just realized something. I am not too handy. That will be, that'll make things faster. All right, that's two. I did like when we found the, uh, whatchamacallit. Come on, baby. I know you want to fall on me. Fall on me. Fall for me. There we go. Yes. Okay. I had an idea. Here is my idea. Uh, when you throw the pot in, it does nothing. But what if that's because he is in like shitty dying mode right and now oh shit i was thinking you could throw the pot in after you uh God damn it. not to be rude but what is your nationality
believe Delu is Indian. I am American. But that's only by citizenship, really. Well, at least it's going to go faster with the, uh... God damn. God damn. And I'm Ray. Ray has a fictional universe. He is from... Indian as of now. That's a good way to put it. Because you are planning on moving. No! No! Oh, Jesus, I survived. Okay, well, that's nice. Oh, God. Whew! That was got to be a close one. All right. Stay out of grabbing range. That's one. Do you have a loophole to get a Toyota truck into the US? <laughs> uh, I mean, you can just transfer trucks into the US, can't you? Oh God, run away. Uh, I do not want to do this again. Please don't make me do this again. Twenty five years. Come on, you big lug. That's two. Not really, but I can find out. Dolu, you don't need to break the law for Davy. 90%, it's a troll. Which truck do you need? I'm dead. I'm dead. Fuck! Five. Five. Five staggers. God damn it. Have you found the boss where you gotta take a leap of faith? Uh, there have been a couple of them, actually. All right. Fire resistance. Uh, Non-physical resistance. My fire resistance is now 75. Hopefully that'll make a difference. Yeah. Um, we did the putrescent night where you have to jump from a coffin. And then we did the ancient dragon man where you have to jump from something. Fuck if I know. Flame me, baby. Pick a prunes. Two hand. Hey, look at that. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Much more manageable amount of damage. Incredible. Only know the one where you jump off a skull. Uh, I mean, I guess it was like a skull. It was like a skull shaped coffin. Oh, the ruins of Ute. Fire Drake Talisman, Equip Spell, Flame Protect Me. We'll do Flame Protect Me if this doesn't work out, but Fire Drake and Pearl Drake should be pretty, pretty badass right now. 
<laughs> Don't lie, we'll game marry you if you come with a cool car slash truck. It's not a good reason to marry someone. Just for their car. If I summon if I summon the summons, they just die instantly, right? There's no possible way that they've been programmed to jump over these flame blasts. What about the bird, though? Look at the damage, so much more manageable. Ah, all right, here's the ultimate test. Is this fire damage resistance enough? Fucking easy. <laughs> Can try the truck, but I am straight. That won't work out. Uh, listen, getting married for a car is not good either way. There's just no, no getting around that. You also like to try a dagger that can actually spins like a shield. I mean, that would probably be good for getting hits in. I have a plan. Though. I've got a plan for this motherfucker. Motherfucker. Am I the motherfucker? Punch, 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 punch. Punch, 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 punch. Ball. Yes. Okay. We've got plenty of room here. Run around, run around, run around, run around, run around. Get him. No. Too, too low. Okay. Mm -hmm. Doe is the best at pro gaming of all time. He's up there for sure. Better than me. Dolu pro gamer. Isaac. No gamer. Are you a pro gamer or are you a no gamer? Remember my street racing days. Uh. Dolu, if Lumi hears that you had uh, street racing game, street racing days. She'll want to know all about it. Oh, you can, you can dodge that. I assume it's harder to dodge. All right, run away. Me, I'm just fighting in my, fighting for my life against these zombies. Let's all give let's all give Ray some words of encouragement. What are you doing? What are you doing, buddy? No, 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 no. OK. All right, that's fine. Keep it up, Ray. You got this. Let's go. All right. One more stagger. I have three healing. We're doing much better than last time. Thanks largely in part to the talismans. I don't think I did any better as a as a person. No brains mean the other players can draw aggro. That's right. Are you fucking kidding me? Modded Honda City is Civic variant in your college days. Um, so my wife is super into cars and she had a, oh God, what's it called? A Scion TC. She had a Scion TC and uh, it was her pride and joy. She loved that car. 
so much. She saved up so much money and bought the car. And then wouldn't you know it, all right, I'm out of healing. This is the time. This is the time. Stop jumping. No. I don't want to do this again. I need you to. I need you to fall. Yes. Show me your face. Get your wife on the horn. Unfortunately, she uh, went to work. Oil soaked tear. Coats nearby enemies with oil in the mixed physic. The resulting concoction temporarily causes the imbiber to break out in an oily sweat, soaking nearby enemies in oil. Oil soaked enemies are highly susceptible to fire damage. We, we have achieved a uh, sweaty gamer status. We found the gamer tier, guys. We found the gamer tier. I was a little more into it, slash had more resources than the normal American. Uh, yeah, we've never, we've never been into the racing scene. Can we sneak around the back of this place? Avoid the furnace guy? It says there's a, a thing back here. Hell yeah. Scion, hell of a ride. Though we were limited only to cars in our region. Yeah, it's a Japanese car, so she likes she likes the Japanese cars a lot. Um, and this TC was her pride and joy. And she was, hello, <gasps> hello. Oh, I should uh, one second. Okay. We ball him. Uh, I should probably keep those pots equipped, right? Uh, just in case this other guy wakes up. No, I need to... I, I forgot that I'm out of healing. I need to stop fucking running around and shit. All right. Uh, Mitsubishi's, Ford's, Honda, Suzuki, Toyota, and Tata. I can't say I'm familiar with Tata. Tata. ETFN, Tata for now. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, the Scion TC was not long for this world. Uh, it all came to a horrifying end when... Um, we were staying with a friend and, um, the car was parked out on the road and some guy in the middle of the night, we weren't in the car. Thank God. Uh, some guy just, <sighs> we might as well do it. We're here. Uh, some guy just rolls out of nowhere. <gasps> Hello? Like speeding, speeding drunk guy and just demolishes the car. Absolutely tragic. Thankfully, like I said, we weren't in the car and there's nothing we can do about it, but the dude was uh let's let's call him not a good person uh he was he was speeding away from the police and uh then like smacked into the car because we were we were kind of on a side road a narrow road uh just absolute tragedy um uh, Tata is an Indian make. Ah, want to hear a funny fact? All of our fancy cars were easily outclassed by a little Hyundai Sancho. That little car just cuts corners like a bee. Damn. See, I wish I knew more about cars, because then I could comment. 
all I can say though is that after after the the tragic passing of the scion, uh, my wife did pick up a. It was like a, a Honda Civic, but it was um, built for sports. Hey, Tom. So am I supposed to turn this on? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Yep. Again. Ah, but now we can get back here. Ho, ho, ho. Who needs to fight? Go away. Who needs to fight you? I'm just going to walk past you. Bad call, Hot Rod. Listen, I, I just run. What the hell is this? Look at this thing. This is a Dark Souls one ass chest. That's not the mimic. That's not the mimic chain. Oh, fuck. Turns out it was a bad call. Is he just activated now? <laughs> I'm, I'm dying. I'm dying. Oh, God. He's just standing there menacing Subaru Impreza my car was modded to look like it okay yes 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 we will we will do the thing but I'm going to uh, switch out my talismans and grab my runes real quick and grab this item before you turn around and fucking scatter blast me. Okay, that just leads out the packs. You calm, you cool, okay. The question is, can we drop pots into this guy? Raise the stone sheathed sword to the dark? What? The sword of darkness. Pulled from its stone scabbard at an altar. No fucking way. Raise the sword aloft and cleave the surroundings with darkness. Deals holy damage and temporarily reduces holy damage negation. Oh, fuck. All right, we are going to do this right. Get a dagger and equip the spinning shield, Ash. What's this? The Sword of Darkness, still. The Sword of Mother Flippin' Darkness. Buy a Scion TC. I mean, I think I think Lumi would love a Scion TC. But as you might imagine, she has also told me her dream car, which is not another Scion TC. It is a Nissan GTR GTX. A Nissan. A dark purple Nissan GT something. GTO? That doesn't sound right. No, two hands. I want to try this thing. Motherfucker. What's the spinning ash? Do I have the spinning ash on me? Probably not. Yeah, I'll have to, I'll have to go grab it from the box. 
GTO or an EVO 10. I see. I see what you're saying. I'm... All my buffs are burnt out. I'm not paying attention to this fight as much as I should. He's got to run from that thing, but I didn't run far enough. GTO are cool, but they have all-wheel drive power and steam. Is that a bad thing? I would assume that's a good thing. Or maybe it's just a different thing. Get staggered. All wheel drive steering is not 7,000 mile reliable. Interesting. I didn't know. Yeah, I know your little three stomp pattern now. Handling and acceleration was all we needed for our streets. Damn, Dodo. This is like, I, please don't, please don't take this as me calling you old, Dodo. But this is why I so deeply prefer to talk to people with more life experience under their belts. Like, you just get, such better stories. Like, fucking, like, street racing stories. So cool. Stop jump. I demand it. By the order of Isaac Anzu, I demand you to stop your jumping. In 1993, all we did was drag race. Fuck me. Fuck me. Yeah, we've got to we've got to figure out this this uh, shit. Use my America blessing. Probably not worth it. Unless he staggers like right now. Out of healing, out of healing. All right. I think this works. I think I can do this. Well, it did a lot of damage, but yeah, there's no way. All right, rather than lose my runes, I'm just going to run this direction. Stay back, foul beast. We were engine swapping Miata and 82 Firebirds. Golden Bow and Flame Grant Strength before crit, if that helps. That might help. Okay. We need... Go to the chest. Find the Ashes of War. So where's the spinning dagger thing?
I didn't have it. Repeating thrusts. Wild strikes. Stormblade. The problem is, unless Golden Vow and Flame grant me strength, give me enough damage to one shot it on the crit, it's kind of not worth it to do. The Ash that Renala does, that would be on her thing, wouldn't it? I do not have her staff. And I think it's unique to her staff. Give us cockroach ashes. Oh, shit. Um, yeah, I think I do. Kindred of Rot. It's only a plus one. But don't we have... Do we have that spell? Uh, I mean, there is this thing. What just hits a bunch of times? Everything that just hits tons of times. We'll try it all. Not the spirit, but a weapon ash for the missiles that they launch. I think that's an incantation. Do I not have the oh intelligence? You kidding me? Um, don't have enough for Black Flame Ritual. Dang it. Beast Sling, probably. Okay, let's try these out. I was a douche my modern self would never hang out with 21 year old me. Ain't that the truth? All right. Yeah, that's the problem with having a level one dude though. It's still just not as fast as punching. That might be faster than punching. If all those little rocks count as a hit. So one flask equals a stagger. I don't have enough flasks, but that is pretty good. Eh. 
Yeah, isn't there uh, a way to do those missiles? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Heal up. I'm trying to reach out here. Heal, refresh. Should be getting close to another stagger. Motherfucker. Go ask a grave. So cryptic. What does it mean? All right. Before we get this guy to uh, fall down, let's get him facing the right direction. Come on, tell me I've got enough. Okay, so it's not quite one flask per stagger. But pretty close. Experimenting. Experimenting with the best way to defeat these guys. Merry times. The past was fine, but now is best. Not again. Oh, brother. I don't think I survived this one. Nope. Okay. <sighs> Is this one of the ones that you can... I don't know. I feel like, I feel like I'm trying to do... Too much shit here. Who would be good? Who would be good? I don't know if anyone would be good. Oh, the hawk. The hawk. I have a hawk at plus eight. Spinning weapon is sold by Roger. <gasps> You're right. Okay. We have Roger's bell bearing, don't we? All right, Hawk. Hawk does not get hit by the thing. Hawk gets hit by the thing. Fuck. Hawk definitely gets hit by that. All right. 
time to run around and avoid the fire uh, droppings. All right. Let me finish. Let me finish this attempt, and then we're gonna. <laughs> oh yeah, lack of bows. Let me finish this attempt, and then we're gonna go grab that spinning dagger ash. Oh, and where's the um, uh? Yeah, take that, and that, and that, and that, and that. Take that too, and one of these, and one of those. Uh, where's the the bug spell? You need to south. I'll south. Damn it. To find the hell spot. I don't know. This feels pretty close right now. Not gonna lie. Yes, face, face this way. Nice and away from the wall. Okay. I mean, it does decent damage because it hits his face, but it, I don't know if you can get it in the, the thing. The bug spell is sold by the lady in the church she killed. The lady in the church I killed. In the main game? Wait. Then is it a bell bearing, right? If I've killed the person who sells it? your bodyguard attacked you? Are you talking about Jolon? Hey, this this uh, attempt is actually going pretty well. Yeah, Jolon. Okay. Are you talking about Count Emir? I have Count Ymir's uh, bell bearing. All right. I haven't turned it in yet. That was the lady, Ymir. <clears throat> I don't know uh, the preferred gender pronouns, but Ymir did seem like a count as opposed to a countess. See, this is... Okay, here's why I don't like this boss. Uh, we try not to misgender people. That's threads sold by Gowry. Is that the bug spell? Find the gender of that foot. This... I wonder. Your feet have a gender? And if so, should we be including that information on the foot wiki of all the celebrities? Sure, Angela Jolie. Angelina Jolie has, has, has feet. But what gender are her feet? 
What if you're whacking it to male feet on a female body? I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Yep. Well, I mean, like, according to Ymir, fingers have gender. Come on. Fall the fuck down. You punk. <laughs> That's true. Whatever their gender is, it's the one that uh, completely destroys me. Which uh, would be any. Any gender is allowed to do that. Just fall down. Just fall down. Why won't you fall down? Motherfucker. He's so close to just dying anyway. But he's gonna fall down here. I just know it. I hate you. Tedious. Exactly. Like, once you figure out the basic pattern, it's not even about, um, it's not even about doing anything anymore. Just like punching, keep punching, keep dodging until it's done. Enhances the attacks and cost of HP in mixed physic. The resulting concoction temporarily increases attack power, but drains HP over time. Interesting. That is the name of this boss. I'm not even giving it the, the good grace to be called a boss. Okay. Um, Gowry. Fuck is Gowry. Sage Gowry. <laughs> Fuck that. Just attack. I know, right? Why don't, why isn't there even better armor that I can just ignore the stupid stomping and just keep attacking? Why are we going here? Uh, we're getting bug. We're getting bug. It's time, it's time to become bug. Millicent? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry to say this, but... <clears throat> Millicent's dead. Where is the place that I can drop down safely? Over here? Probably. The fast way to get the gallery. You killed Millicent the innocent? Oh no, no. I didn't kill her. She just died. upset let's reset him <laughs> that's how you advance npc quests in elden ring are you a monster i am a chimera which is a type of monster that is true sacramental bud what's up bud sacramental bud are you a sacramental bud or are you a Crystal bud. I think you can actually get up here too. Soup. Yep. Look at me, nice and stable on my horse. Yeah. Nice and stable. Hello, Gary. Have you calmed down? Uh, he's not selling me stuff. What do I do here? I need the guidance of the internet. Let's wrap to Sacramento Bud. 
<laughs> there are a few times in the game where I'm so disgusted by the choices of my phone plays. Uh, yes, let's. However, before we do, I want to see what the hell I'm supposed to do here. That I need to actually cover my mouth. <gasps> yes. Um. I, I don't know what to tell you. She died. She, yes. She died. That's bad. Um. You did not save Millis. I I couldn't. It was impossible. All NPCs. Let's go. Where are you, Gower? Gower. Oh. Uh, okay. Let's try this. You survived the first blood moon. All right. Let's try this. What do you drop? Okie dokie. <laughs> That's what you gotta do. Look at the bell bearing. Hi, buddy. My kitty has come to join me. Hello, kitty. All right, time to drop off some bell bearings. Scarlet Rot. This is all, all we can do. Hello, ladies. All right. Emir's bell bearings. Oh, that might be a good one. The Phalanx. Carrying Retaliation. Flintstone Nail. Ooh. Flintstone Nails. Real creative. Real creative uh, naming here. The Fleeting Microcosm. The Broken and Discarded are fully willing to cling to Fleeting Simulacra, earning them some modicum of sympathy. Wow, just like uh, 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 VTubers. All right. Oh, right, right, right. right. Gowrie's Bell Bearing Sorceries. Incantations. <gasps> Pest Threads. Okay, got it. And then Rogier's Spinning Weapon. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. How are we looking on upgrade materials? Let's just get a few more of those for a good measure. Two more of those. A couple more of those. Anzu, I know Anzu has never heard a good joke. That's true. I've yet to hear a joke that makes me laugh. <laughs> it's true. Pest threads. A technique of the pale pests who crawl through the lands of the affected by the scarlet rot. The abandoned children of the goddess. Oh, you gotta go? Okay. Well, thank you, Davey. We'll probably be wrapping up here soon, so don't worry. You won't miss any of the plot. Um, spinning weapon. Yeah, let's, let's uh, set up a weapon with spinning weapon. Talk to you later, babies. Um, what do we got here? What's a good one? Oh, spinning great katana. Let's go. We can even make it heavy. Can't. I'm not interested in making it cold or magic uh even though the frost buildup is really nice actually uh, 125 uh just because the scaling well i guess you know what let's do cold great katana actually because if it's got spinning weapon on it it's gonna be it's gonna be real sick 
uh, for applying status effects. And then we can memorize. Where is it? Pest threads. Okay, cool. Let's try. Um, where the hell was I? Castle Watering Hole. Seems like Elden Ring went well. Bruh, we just spent like half an hour beating two enemies. Not great. Could be better. Could be better. All right. I am on heavy load now, but let's try this. Oh my god. Yeah, you know that one's going on there. All right. Now that we've defeated you, is there anything else over here? Oh, right. I wanted to upgrade the Sword of Darkness. That shit seems cool as fuck. Yeah, it turns out all you needed to unleash the sheath was an altar of darkness. Right here. What else do we get? A golden arc incantation, right? Neat. Cool. Good rewards. Um, yeah, this giant golden arc. I guess now we go south. To the cursed woods. I'm really digging this build, though. We got the palm blast. We getting kicking ass. We out here kicking ass. Imagine if there are no more furnace golems left. Ah, what a beautiful world that would be. What a wonderful world. I see trees of... Wow, really, guys? Green and clouds of white. Bright, gentle day. Gross. And dark, cold night, I think to myself. Smiley the Millier, heart is breaking. Is that another song? I don't know that one. Uh, okay. I know I'm supposed to keep going south, but we can't just walk past uh, obvious sites of interest. Even if they contain the, the very grabby bugs that I do not like. Like, right? We can go this way. Oh, it's another Frank Sinatra one. I, hmm. so that's the thing is my knowledge of Frank Sinatra is like totally just based on pop culture. I have not really gotten into his greater discography. Also, uh, can I just say, my stomach is feeling a lot better today. I hope that keeps up. Let's give it up for slightly less tummy hurty than usual. I beat your ass. Oh, no. Babies. It's time. It's time for Palm Blast. Oh, it didn't even hit one of them. That's right, give me my flask back. But when I think about my voice type, you know, I feel like I could do the crooning, right? What do we got here? I shall find my center under the cascading waters. Ho, ho, ho. 
The dry leaf seal. Boosts golden ring of light incantations. Sacred seal of the spiritual seekers known as the dry leaf sect. Those who saw the decline of the air tree in the fallen leaves long ago embraced themselves for the weakening of order and embraced a strict faith. And then they made to serve a new god. The new god being Mikola? Lantern. So they were soothsayers and martial artists, and they were all like, we know. Though I am so far ahead of you that I have already lanterned up. Huh, so that's what's up with the dry leaves, huh? Um, I thought that was a fucking furnace golem again. What are we doing? Oh, I have fire palms. Haha. <laughs> Hi, Flower. Don't think you're going to last long against me. Oh, God, is there more than one? There is. Okay, never mind. Goodbye. Under the center of the cascading waterfall. Uh huh. Okay. Skidoo. Bear. I'm so bad at keeping track of my health. I'm used to this heavy armor. Heaviest armor. I'm a heavy armor lad. How the fuck did I get here? We came here through the... We came here through the, the secret basement in... The... <gasps> Bug. Bug! Get back here, you little punk. <gasps> Summer 8. How was y'all's exposure to the good old female Melania? I mean, Flappy and Paler, I mean, Mesmer. Ah, uh, Mesmer was the last boss that Dolu and I fought together. And very cool boss. <gasps> Under the center of the waterfall, I will find my center. Yo! The dry leaf clones. Gold necklace found under the breast belongs to a group of spiritual seekers known as the dry leaf sect. This sect rejects dependence on all other on others in all matters of faith, seeking self discipline and self sufficiency above all else. Okay, I think that I think south is the way to keep going. So let's check this direction. Uh, very cool fight. Very lore driven. Yeah, Mesmer's cool. Mesmer's a good fight. Very flashy, very high tempo. Um, but then, of course, the Eastern name is Muslim. Okay. But then, of course, uh, the interesting thing as well was the fact that you can stance break him. So that ended up going... Uh, really well for us <laughs> because palm blast is a broken ass thing rock shasa huh fuck are you he's got a great katana not what i wanted to do i wanted to do palm blast look at the damage the damage is so good there's nothing quite like it. There's nothing quite like 
a palm blast on a Sunday afternoon. Even with buffs running out, Palm Blast is just too good. Ladies! Feel me tonight. Rakshasa armor and Greek tongue. The graves of Rakshasa soaked in the spurting blood of her victims. Ragged, tatters of ragged cloth shut out haphazardly, as if her lust for carnage threatens to break free. Increases damage dealt to foes, but greatly increases damage taken by the wearer. Huh. Cut down and devour. Only those who repeat the cycle without rest can truly subvert the self and become Rakshasa. Indeed. A great katana with the tempering pattern of his blade forever stained by red, red with blood. A Berserker's weapon used to endure enemy attacks and reply with one's full fury. When attacking, the wielder is less likely to stagger from counterattacks, but will also take increased damage. So you just take more damage from this entire set, but it gives you increased damage dealt to foes and less likely to stagger. Weed Cutter. Perform scythe like horizontal with the storm, cutting men down if they were weeds. Additional inputs allow for the continuation of the attack for as long as stamina remains. Let's give it a try. I don't have the decks for it. Can I still do the thing? Uh, can I still do the thing if I... I don't think that, I, I don't know if that's even the thing. Rakshasas are hin important Hindu lore elements. Yeah, they're um, uh, Hindu demons, right? Try with America Source Hill. Oh, true. I always forget that I can do that shit. Um, Radagon Source Seal and we also need the dexterity seal. And then we can use the blade. All right, weed cutter. Oh, ooh. Crazy AOE potential. And it just keeps going. Okay. Interesting. Cool. Don't have the stats for it. <laughs> Sorry. I discovered Rakshasa through God Eater and Vocaloid from Monster Songs. Now to the grasslands. We have a weed issue. Discount waterfall? It is kind of. That's okay, though. Not everything has to be waterfall. Um. It's not a dance either, so the dancer robes don't help. Eh? Oh, just a dude gem. Um, so Dolu, you may not know this, but there's actually a historical misinterpretation of the Rakshasa in Western media. How about that? Uh, it all goes back to Dungeons and Dragons, actually. May want to hand this weapon over out to the gardeners of the lands of terrain. True. Oh, I know it's I know it's uh, time for me to stop, but I just don't want to. I want to keep playing. I want to keep playing. So here's the story. Um, in the seventies. There was a uh, TV show that was kind of like a supernatural mystery of the week sort of TV show. And one of the episodes, they said, 
Ah, this person is possessed by the spirit of a Rakshasa. And, uh, I mean, they were just using, uh, it's called Orientalism, essentially. They were just using the Rakshasa as kind of a, um, evil foreign demon. They weren't, they didn't actually do any research on what is a Rakshasa or where it comes from or what the history is behind it. Uh, and then, so they made this, they made this person possessed by a demon, like a big, hairy, scary monster, which is nothing like uh, an actual Rakshasa, right? Well, Gary Gygax, uh, the creator of D&D, uh, just so, no, 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 you don't get to uh, nom me, just so happened to see this episode and say, hey, I want some Rakshasas in my Dungeons and Dragons game. So he described them as big, hairy, scary demons. Uh, and he said, they're like tigers. He did a Hollywood writing technique, exactly. Uh, and uh, then in the Second edition of D and D. Ooh, the hippos drop skadoos. Is that just a thing? Always, hippos always drop skadoos. Oh, there's another one. Another one. Will you too drop a skadoo? Let's find out. Um. So in D&D's second edition, um, an artist took the idea of the tiger person Rakshasa and added another element to it, which is that uh, their hands were backwards, right? In the art, in the second edition D&D, they said, ah, they're not just uh, tiger people, because now tiger people exist in D&D. You know, we can't just have them like being tiger people. Uh, they also have backwards hands. Uh, and somehow this D&D bastardization interpretation just ended up being the interpretation of Rakshasa's for like 30, 40 years. Like, it's kind of ridiculous how long the the misinterpretation persisted. Is that all that's down here? Just hippos? No, wait. Stairs. Stairs! So... Davy said to keep going south to get to the cursed forest. If there are stairs down, we must keep going down. We haven't been down here yet. These stairs are much better designed than the ones in the base game, though. I will say. They're a little bit closer together. Sure. And that's helpful. Want to know how we say that word? I do, because I'm guessing it's not the American style, uh, you know, like Rakshasa, right? I would love to know the actual pronunciation. Americans, keep your mouth closed while you're talking challenge. Impossible. Americans, don't fill your mouth with every single word challenge. Utterly. Utterly impossible. Okay, we're supposed to keep going south. Get to the cursed forest. But it also looks like there's a... A dungeon? Yeah, there's definitely a dungeon here. Poison! Your words are venomous poison. Your poison running... Where's south? South is the way. Hmm. 
There's the moon. This is south. Is there no way down there? How the fuck? I've been to every edge of this place. Davy said to go south. Look for look for steps down. Is there a spirit spring? No, all the spirit springs have been locked, really. So I doubt there's a spirit spring going down anywhere in the DLC. You know. A locked spirit spring is meant to, to go up. Uh, okay, well, and I don't really want to start another dungeon before uh, we end. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Here's what we're going to do. Oh, there's a waterfall. We're going to check this last little section. There might be stairs next to the waterfall. I mean, there were over here, right? Waterfall. Rock us dark. Rock us dark. Rock us dark? Rock as dark. Rock as dark. Really? That's so cool. That's very different than the American interpretation. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Jalan and Anna are just, say rock as you would say dark. Rark is dark. Rark is dark? Rark is dark? Dark, light, catacombs. Rark is dark. Rark is dark. Oh boy. All right. Uh, lantern. Necessary. Got it. Just. Rock. Oh, try saying rock is dark. Oh, oh. Okay. Sorry. I'm done. Rark. Rakshasa. 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 Rhyme it with dark. I understand now. Rakshasa. Rakshasa. Yeah, that's quite different than Rakshasa. Okay, so I think we're going to do. I think we're going to do this dungeon first thing next time, and then hopefully by then Davy will be on and we can interrogate him about where the hell I'm supposed to go next. Um, did we actually collect some, some, some boss, boss ass bossiness today? Oh, we collected some boss ass bossiness yesterday. Did I forget to fucking, uh, Shasa as sus, but shus. So Rakshus, Rakshus. Rakshus, Rakshus, Rakshus. <laughs> I apologize for butchering the language. Rakshus. Did I forget to throw up my uh, Rakshas? Rakshas. Precisely. Oh. Nice. Rakshas. That's the way we say it. It's it's a lot more it's a lot more demonic that way. Rakshus. Rakshusa. <laughs> no, no. Rakshusha. No, no, that that's not correct. <laughs> I forgot to I forgot to upload the stream yesterday to YouTube. 
You have to forget the last A. Interesting. So one of the interesting things about learning German is a lot of times in English, you also kind of leave off the last vowel. So like in the word time, you forget about the E. It's not timey. It's uh, just time. And Shiva is just Shiv. Interesting. Rakshus. Rakshus. Thank you, Dolo. That's so cool. However, one of the interesting things is when I'm learning German. Uh, yeah, actually. Um, <laughs> uh, you have to pronounce the E. You have to pronounce it every time. So, like, um, review time. Yes. Let's review. Uh, let's review quickly, because I am starting to get hungry. I hunger. Um, I guess we can let this, this play while I, I wait. Uh, What's I was, was I going to say? Yeah, like um, in German words, you pronounce every vowel at the end of a word, right? So it's not uh, like, oh God, I can't. My mind is going completely blank on German words that end in E. German words that end in E. So, uh, like, this word, bara, is pronounced with the E at the end. Bara. Ich fara. I drive. Ich fara. Uh, but in, um, in English, you would probably just pronounce it far. Far. Because you leave off the E's at the end of it. Uh, okay. Type, pipe, paste. <laughs> Those are English words, though. English words that end in E. I was trying to think of a German one. Um, let's review. Uh, so first off, We have Count Emir, Mother of Fingers. So I'm going to try to summarize this guy's lore here real quick. Essentially, uh, he believes that the greater will gave birth to Metir, Mother of Fingers. Uh, and then... That is the cause, the root of all these problems that people are having with the Erd tree. So he's like, I will be the new mother. I will be your mother. Finger guy, perfect candidate for our spa, a masseuse. It's true. Look at all those fingers coming out of his robes. And who doesn't want to, uh, you know, have have someone they can call mom? at the masseuse and not feel embarrassed, right? Charge now. Good night, y'all. Take care. It was interesting learning the mystics. It was, wasn't it? Got Dolu to thank for that. Um, I like it. A masseuse. A mommy masseuse. But here's Matir. Uh, the actual mother of fingers. And... I will say this attack is utter bullshit. <laughs> Look at this thing. Um, how how are you supposed to get in there? You just can't. Um, but this is the mother, the mother of fingers. Maybe maybe we just need maybe we need more than one masseuse, <gasps> or maybe. Matir can be the mother of the uh, mother of the house. 
<laughs> oh, or the front yard fountain light. Yes. Well, if we're, if we're starting a massage parlor, we will need lights. And Matir certainly provides a lot of light. I like it. Dolu, I'm so glad you're here. Couldn't do this without you. Uh, then we have the putrescent knight who... Uh, the lore behind this guy is he was human remains that was that fell in love with Saint Trina. Human remains that fell in love with Saint Trina. Not too bad, although Palm Blast is OP. And he did take out both Jolan and Anna. The ambience of our second phase theme is the sounds of the black hole. Really? Oh, that's cool. Ah, uh, talk about talk about awesome sound design. Yeah, because they released that uh, sound of the black hole audio. The fuck is this? It's literally a corpse that learned to love. That's all it is. I haven't turned in that remembrance yet, have I? I don't think I have. I'm so bad at remembering to do that. Uh, yeah, this is like St. Trina's uh, Guardian. We did a whole St. Trina quest. You trust at night. Um, you know, a corpse that learned how to love. Where the hell would you employ that? Maybe like uh, body disposal. Maybe, maybe not. Where do we put the death right birds? Oh, nighttime secretaries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this this guy would be the greatest nighttime janitor. Yeah, let's put him with the other death folks um, at night. And he can clean up. He's used to being in the, the corpse piles and as a as a business, we have lots of corpse piles, so there you go. <laughs> oh, Red Bear. Yeah, Dolu, this guy stole your hat. Um, he's nameless. He's nameless as well. Uh, so we can put him in records retention. But we definitely want to teach him that it's not okay to steal people's hats. Damn, Palm Blast is so good. Uh, and then we got another one, right? Oh, we had a Falling Star Beast. Right. Where did we put the Falling Star Beasts? That was... Um, I mean, you know what we do need? Sabretooth Movie Division? I was thinking we do need an industrial-sized can opener. Kink, 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 kink. <laughs> Um, the Red Bear should also be in the movie division, though, right? I totally forgot we're making a movie now. It's, what is it? Wolverine versus Yoda. That's the movie. All right. Industrial can opener. And then we have uh, Rakshus. Rakshas. Rakshas. Honestly... I love that pronunciation because it sounds like an actual demon as opposed to Rakshasa, which sounds goofy as hell. Rakshas. She is also nameless. She became a Rakshas, Rakshas by uh, devouring the souls of the many. Rakshas. Rakshas. What if, what if she's like the villain that Wolverine and Yoda have to team up against in the end? She's got the, she's got the fucking credentials for it. I like this. Every movie needs a good villain. You know. Is that it? That's it. We did it. Oh my gosh. Nico. Hello. I was actually thinking about things I could do once I have a 3D model. And 
um, once I have a 3D model, I could set it up so maybe like something explodes in 3D when you enter. I do be late, but it's okay. I hope you're well. I hope you're doing well. We uh, we just finished categorizing the bosses that um, are in this DLC. I'm doing my best. Uh, that's all we can ask. Oh, actually, hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. Hey, listen up, Nico. I got a question for you. Um, because you make those super cool image boards for clothing, right? Outfit boards? Outfit boards. Outfit concepts outfit concepts uh do you see any way that i could be punk punk rock how would it how would, what's nerd punk look like what's nerd punk what's that like how does that look? What would that even entail? Nerd punk. Nerd punk rock. Because I'm thinking I need to get a... Um, I need to get someone to... Uh, do an overlay. Like, this suit is an overlay. Um... Dark Academia, but punk. I like that. I like that. Punk Librarian, Isaac. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I need. Also, insanely, there are only 14 more bosses in this entire... Um, in this entire DLC. What the hell? Do you think we can do it? 14 bosses. It looks like it's divided up into three areas that I haven't been to yet. Redownload my trusty lap and see what I can do. I would love to see it. I I want to do a punk rock arc. Maybe then I can I can show off my guitar hero skills. <gasps> Finally. There are people who stream guitar hero, right? Surely. I'm looking... Okay, we're on the Recluse River right now. Yeah. So there are only three more areas. It is the Abyssal Woods. That must be the spooky woods that David was talking about. The Ancient Ruins of Rao, which we have gone to Rao Base and gotten the map for. And then Enir Ilim. Whatever the fuck that means. So we have three more areas. We have 14 more bosses. And tomorrow I'm streaming on the Zarkon's channel. So we can't do it then. But what say we do a super long stream Sunday and see what we can do? See what we can do? See what we can do! That would be sick. Let's do it. Um, the maps have been very helpful for this place. Yeah, so I've got so many ideas for things to do. Punk rock Isaac, game show host Isaac, uh, or, or even talk show host, sitcom Isaac. Sitcom dad, Isaac. But I think for now, I should stop talking before I commit to anything that I would take forever to do. Let's find someone to raid. 
Lots of people playing Elden Ring. We love that. Who can we raid? Oh shit! Soulstone is is streaming. And still going. All right, found, found, that was easy. Raid message time. All right, well, uh, before I do this, let me just check something. Okay, we did not get any raids. That's okay. To all those who stopped by anyway, thank you so much for the good conversation, the good company, and of course, for proving that I am not alone. No matter how lonely I may be in the game of Elden Ring itself. So if you're still in chat, and I see some of you are, uh, please grab that raid message, and let's go say a warm hello to Soulstone, who is a fellow VTuber with big dad energy that uh, we stand and support forever. Uh, what else is there to say? My name is Isaac Anzu. I'm feeling better today. I appreciate all the support of people wishing me well, despite tummy hurting. And uh, I will catch you next time. Sunday or Saturday, depending on where you are in, in the time continuum. Possibly. Possibly. The last stream before my vacation. Anyway, uh, that's an announcement for next stream. Yeah, next stream we're gonna have a big announcement. Big announcement is not many streams remaining. Oops, spoilers. <laughs> I'm too small to do spoilers. Anyway, I'll see you next time. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let those bitcoins bite. Farewell.